with power of destruction two times every week I'm sure and saying the recommended element is completely voided to the point where take whatever is best for you and so with that I am taking my favorite combination and that is the good old-fashioned the combination which even back on the soft launch days the, the, the power combination. I think out of every single weapon combination that there is, this is just the go to, I want to say. Um, just kind of being like an overall default of uh, the combo weapons. And with that, what I like to pair it up with is. Ooh, oh, wait, I don't need to actually apply that. This is only good if the enemy has a weakness, but this enemy doesn't have a weakness, so I think this is completely voided for this time round. Oh, you know what, we'll just get the skill cooldown, there we go. And the reason being is because the skills that I like to use, and because we're catering to the whole crit side of things, because realistically with these weapons, you know, the Scythe itself gives you that additional crit rate once you're below that 70% mark on your HP, which will then effectively buff up on the Plum Sword to allowing you to do more crit damage, of course. Not only that, of course, it also helps out on the crit rate. So obviously with these two weapons together, the whole crit meta is just completely elevated, especially with obviously if you built your Wu in the crit wave, which most of us have. Um, and so with the ruins that I tend to run to give myself the best damage outcome is the light of death dance because um, of course you get that 30 percent for 10 seconds and then <laughs> i mean i've done a whole video on it but boys let me tell you this ruin if you're able and if you're lucky to ever this is my first one this is my only and first legendary ruin but if you ever get lucky 80 percent crit hit damage so that's kind of what i'm maximizing now i should clarify even before i got this legendary so even when it was in its rare form I was making good use because it was still giving me crit damage increase. So even before I had the legendary version of it, I was still using this and this together to give me the uh, crit damage support alongside with these two weapons <coughs> and then blessing stones. Um, if the enemy does have a weakness, I would always cater to getting the weakness advantage, and then I would have to obviously switch up uh, the plum sword because I always, I, you know, I tend to keep the scythe one no matter what it is, unless. There's um, a dark weakness, which is on the light typing, but um, we'll just go with the cooldown. Here's the thing, because, I mean, when was soft launch? Like a month before the global release? Like, even now, this dark combination weapon are still meta and, like, default to go to for, like, high amount of damage. I get it, like, you know, people are mixing and matching, and the scythe is kind of, like, the number one overall universal weapon for any type of combination. But it begs the question on like future weapons, um, you know, are we going to get any more combinations to the uh, to the level of how these dark weapons are coming across? Uh, that would be interesting to see. I mean, I guess they kind of tried it with um, the uh, Scatty Pistol, but I don't think that kind of, I don't know, to, to me it doesn't really fit that well, to be honest. I mean, it's doable with the Grim One and the Scatty Pistol, but I, to, to the level to how these dark weapons are, I just, I don't know, it's not kind of hitting right. Let's go full bloom. Boom, full bloom, let's go. That will give me my crit damage increase. Let's get some. I should have done it the other way around, actually. I did the uh, skills the wrong way around, but that's fine. Dodge. Okay, let's apply this. 500 million. I think that's two mil from the board right there. Beautiful. Dodge. Full bloom again. It does so much damage. Oh my god. Okay, he's running. Okay. And then I'm gonna spin into it. Not the damage I was hoping for, but it's fine. Okay, I'm not gonna dodge just yet. Can we break it? Oh my god. There we go. Damn it. Nice. Oh, this this is gonna be beautiful right now. Charge it. Boom. Boom. And then the scythe. Oh yeah, this is maximum. Oh wait, I've got my ult. Damn it. I was gonna. Uh. I, uh, okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I kind of stuck with it. Okay, that's fine, we're good. Boom. Charge it, charge it, charge it. Boom. There we go. Break this. Nice. Okay, there we go. I mean, it's working nicely, to be honest. I, I was going to full bloom it, but I'm not going to full bloom it. I will dodge this into that. Can we break it? Come on. Break it. There we go. Nice. Oh, we're going to get... Roll into that. 
just gonna go for the one charge. Even if I one bar charge that punch, it does like half a mil. It's, it's actually pretty strong. But again, legendary ruin, I get it. All right, we're going with this. There's a reason why I only charged at one time, because uh, trying to get in the scythe and uh, the chip damage with the uh, full bloom. Don't know why I used my summon there, that was pretty stupid of me, but it is what it is. All right, we're, we're hoping to get like around uh, 140, 150. That, that's kind of like, well, I want to kind of get it out. All right, let me charge this. Bop, there we go. Good break. There we go. I brought Emma along for the breakage, but typically I do bring um, Jibu along, but since I'm going to try and maximize points here, we will try and benefit getting the water damage increase because of um, Alicia helping out uh, Jibu. Bop. Okay, I didn't have to do that. Okay. Full bloom it. Oh yeah, full bloom, nice. Okay, we got a little bit of tag on it. There we go. Beautiful. Oh, that was an ult. Nice. That helped me out beautifully. Alright, let's... Uh, one, two, three. Good damage, and then in with the side. I think that is going to be the beautiful combination that I'm really liking. You just go with the crit damage um, ruin, and then... Uh, yeah, and then you just go straight in with the scythe. <laughs> that really is just maximizing damage, to be honest. That's kind of like the best combination that I just truly love right now. So you just go literally... Oh no, I, I'm, did I activate my ruin? I did. Oh no. Okay, that's fine. I activated the scythe there. Okay, that's fine. Right, we'll make do with the 30% increase in crit hits. That then leads in with the ultimate. I don't know how much time we've got left. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Oh, we've got 20 seconds. Okay, that's that's good. That's good. Obviously, the good thing about the Plumsaw 2 is that it does help out in MP regeneration. So that's something to also take note of. Because uh, I will say, when it comes to the MP usage from the site, it is a lot. And it does drain a lot quicker. Okay. There we go. Just gonna dodge. Okay, we've got, we got chips. We've got chips. Alright, what do we do? What do we do? 139. Okay. We'll take that. We'll take that. Okay, we might be doing a lot more better here this time around. This is just popping off so beautifully. All right, we might be able to get our ult here too. Yep, nice. I was gonna dash to uh, get the plum going, but that's fine. We can make do with how it is. There we go. Also, I should really mention I've got blades on too because um, obviously Choi doesn't really need the crit, so I'm just gonna go full on damage here. That's pretty much what we're going with. In it. Nope. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I love how just choice just stays there. Appreciate the help, my boy. Alright. Drop it. Let's go. We can break this before he does anything. Wait. Do not go anywhere. Thank you very much. Appreciate your cooperation. Okay. Then we're gonna go in with this. Bob. Ah, I had the um Okay, that's fine. Might as well make some usage out of the crit damage. Why not? Okay. Uh, I'm not going to summon just yet. No point. Okay, here we go. Gonna roll. Let's see if you can get the break. Come on, girl. You got you got a break all over you. There we go. Wait. Okay. For some reason, Jew was not breaking there. And I was getting worried. There we go. Time of one second. Holy. Okay, let's summon. Let's go. This is it. Big boy damage. Big boy damage. Big boy damage. There we go. So I'm just going to activate the katana here. Nice. Nice. And... Bow! Okay. I, I feel like sometimes my um, ruins aren't hitting. There we go. Nice. Okay. I'm going to just do this. I got 10 seconds of this extra 30%, so I'm actually going to do this. And then I'm going to drop that, get the 80%, and then I'll lead in with the ultimate. Love that. And then you should wake up. I, may, I'm, I might be able to get some chip damage off, actually. Could I have used the katana there? I probably could have, actually, but uh, that's no point. Okay, that's... Uh... Okay, well, I completely botched that. Okay. Come on, drop it, drop it, drop it. Thank you very much. Thank you, boo. Okay. 
Come on, bring the arm hit. Oh, that range actually helped me out. Quickly. There we go. I think we still had that 80% still helping us out, so I think we're chilling. Get that 30% going. Beautiful. Nice. Had time to kind of do a little bit of tagging too. Okay. Might as well break this. Get whatever chip damage off as I can. Whatever chip damage we can get. Okay. What we got? 139. 125. Uh, hey, it worked. <laughs> I was quickly trying to do maths in my head to see where I was trying to hit. So that's kind of where we're hitting. Again, doing okay. I can hit harder. I think the most points I've ever managed to get was like one, oh no, two, 280, 290. I think that's the most. Um, but it seems I'm hitting around about the, two, the, the, the quarter of a mil mark, which isn't too bad. Um, I know I can hit harder. Yeah, 264. I, you know, I, I, I can get a little bit more than that. But pretty much just to give you guys a rough idea on um, the combination that I'm kind of using uh, to give myself big boy marks is... Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm really catering to the uh, crit. So yeah, as it stands also, I believe these are the only ones, uh, rune-wise, that can support you in the crit damage department. Um, well, boosting it, should I say. So, But anyway, just kind of wanted to throw that out there, uh, just to show you guys uh, my favorite combination for Power of Destruction um, when there's no typing uh, being played. Uh, just really crit support. Even when the weakness is dark, you can still, I mean, well, honestly, if you run this, even with, because when it is dark, um, light attribute uh, get nerfed. I mean, they don't do as much damage, but I still utilize this because of the 30%. And it's there where I'm closely reaching um, the uh, 300 mark. Uh, what we get? What we got? Houston. Ooh, wait, do I not have this? Wait, this is my chance to get a legendary. Please, please. Let it be. What do I even want? Pre <laughs> Preferably. Oh my god. Preferably the one and any talent. Well, and any blessing stone that I'm using. Okay. Am I gonna get my first blessing stone? Ah. Oh.